So I go by the name of Mike T. Yeah, I don't usually do this, but I'm gonna do a, a quick uh, spoken word piece for you guys. This is also my second piece, so kind of bear with me. So uh, it goes a little bit something like this. Gnosko. There are three things in life that will endure. Faith, hope, and love. The greatest of these is love. But if love is forever, how then do we, as people who are limited by life, fathom that which is limitless? Obsessed by the press and oppressed by what we believe to be defined as love. Yeah, we love our kids. Yeah, we love our wives. But can we deny the love we got for that episode of Suits? Or maybe that four-wheeler that our dealer calls a coup. Now I digress. For before we speak love, we must speak of a concept that is timeless. Mindless, we are caught up with the actions of the past and the present. But in order to love, we must bridge a gap between that which is never ending with that which is promised to end. How then do we as people say we love a sport or a food? Turn right around, come to Christ and say we love him too? Yeah, she loved the crew. But what's love without knowledge? What's love without understanding? Without dialogue? According to my generation and my timeline, a love without these three things is a light, a follow, a subscription. So as we continue to subscribe to this world of facts, one hit wonders, and boundaries, may we remember the one thing that bridges the gap between now and forever and ever and ever. Love is that bridge, but knowledge is that love. There are three things in life that will endure. Faith, hope, and love. The grace of these is love. Thank you.